Eighth and final race of the BMW IBSF four-man bobsleigh World Cup from snowy Lake Placid, New York. Adam Amore from Germany, World Championship bronze medalist in the four-man in his first race weekend in Lake Placid. Only his sixth four-man World Cup start with a good getaway 509 and more challenging to be among the front runners. Hasn't done the entire four-man season, all the two-man come to that, but has been one of the stars of the German program. And Amor with a good run early in the heat, getting ahead of America's Frank Del Duca to take the early lead. Osher's Marcus Trichel finished eighth in Lake Placid last season with his regular crew, Sasha Steppen, Marcus Sammer and Christian Huber. Another strong start gave Trichel the opportunity to shine. The track has been fast, hard and tricky, but he managed to navigate the major dramas, heading down towards the chicane and getting a good fast run through. 100th in front into the final corners, but a double tap on the wall would see him drop just behind. Next led up, Germany's Francesco Friedrich. He's had nine races here, but only in the last two has he even had a medal of any colour. And none of those have been a gold. Lake Placid is the one track on which he's raced where he has yet to win. Maybe the tenth one would be the charm. It was a good looking run, a clean chicane and enough speed to take the lead away from his teammate Adam Amor. Francesco Friedrich led midway through the first heat. In his 88th World Cup four-man, he was looking for his 55th medal and his 32nd win. Switzerland's Seaman Friedli finished in ninth place in last season's race in Lake Placid with Dominic Schleffer, Luca Rolli and Andy Haas behind him. A 5-12 getaway gave them a strong chance to be in contention. Fifth time here for Friedley, but only his second race as a driver. His 23rd in the four-man. He couldn't stay with the pace of Francesco Friedrich, dropping behind the German and teammate Adam Amor down into fourth at the line. In four previous four-man World Cups on this track, Johannes Lochner has had just one medal, a silver in December 2019. This was his 59th four-man World Cup start, and with the crew behind him giving him an epic getaway, 5.02, he was in the mix right from the beginning. But again, the speed just drifted away from the sled early on, mistakes in 7, 8 and 9, but a clean chicane allowing him to bring it back and challenge his teammate all the way to the line. It would be a close battle going into the second heat, 1700 separating the top two. Final sled in the first heat, Taylor Austin of Canada, this relatively new young crew. Taylor had finished sixth in the previous year's race here in Lake Placid. But with only the 13th fastest start from his young crew, would he be able to have an effect on the 2024 race? Well, as the run progressed, clearly he would. Best speed of all into Shady, a good chicane, and then right at the bottom, coming a long way back from behind to put himself into a strong fifth position, tied with Seaman Friedley. It looked like the second heat would have plenty going for it. But unfortunately, the weather gods had other ideas. The ice started to break up at the bottom of the track. Both Seaman Friedley and Marcus Trichel falling victim to it as it gouged their runners. And in the end, there was no choice left for the jury. They had to cancel the second heat with just three sleds remaining. And the end result would be that of the first heat on its own. So Francesco Friedrich gets his first win in Lake Placid ahead of teammates Johannes Lochner and Adam Amor. And that is enough to guarantee Francesco Friedrich the four-man Crystal Globe ahead of Emil Tsipoulis and Johannes Lochner.